How long have you been, uh, how long have you been working on this record? About 31 years. That you've been working on every record the whole time. Sure. But, um, I've really been, I, I got together with about uh, four or five songs in March, February or March, and sent them to uh, Dave and Rick to record some parts for it. But I didn't really know exactly what I was going to do with it, and then, um, but knew it would probably be a record, probably be this year. And uh, then by about April, May, um, when I hooked up with the guys from uh, Vero, um, it started to kind of turn into something different. always talking about how record sales are down since the internet um, it's you know it's it's harder to sell music um, there, there's a lot of the free stuff out there cutting the competition this is a great way I think for uh, for Ryan or for, or for anybody to um, reinvent what an album is <laughs> Well, it's a very artistic piece, that's for sure, and stuff. Like, you know, it's very, you know, it's different and stuff. So, which it will catch a lot of people's eye, a lot of colors, a lot of, a lot of things that pop out at you. The whole ignorance is bliss motto, and uh, you would find that in a crazy town. I think the consumer's ready for something like this. It's not enough just to listen to music anymore. People want to watch it. Crazy Town, a real place? Is it? Is it? Uh, is it an actual like location? It's a crazy town, and it's everywhere. Daddy.